Thanks. Well, one of the area's largest employers is announcing plans to bring even more jobs to the area. News Channel 18's Alex Dyro joins us now on location at the SIA plant in Lafayette. Alex. Jeff and Gina, Governor Mitch Daniels helped Lafayette Mayor Tony Rozworski and SIA leaders today to announce that there will be 100 new jobs coming to the area over the next two years. Now that's all due in large part, they say, to the business-friendly environment right here in Lafayette. It will create approximately 100 new full-time jobs here. SIA is also announcing plans to go ahead with a $75 million expansion to help facilitate the new employees and meet growing demands for Subaru products. Governor Mitch Daniels says he's proud, but it's no coincidence the plant is choosing to expand its Lafayette facility. It's basically the uh, building a climate where a great company like this knows that uh, they invest $75 million, they've got a much better chance to get it back. To help foster that climate, the Indiana Economic Development Corporation is offering SIA up to $950,000 in conditional tax credits and up to $50,000 in training grants, if the company makes good on its job-creating promises. Roswarski met the crowd beaming, excited about the announcement and what it means for the community. Working together, doing the right thing in a collaborative way to help ensure that this is good places for businesses to make investments. So there are good paying jobs in the community. What we need people to do is make sure they have the skill sets, get the training, have that work ethic, show up, work as a team, work hard. Uh, and there are good paying jobs here in the community. To find out how you can apply for one of these 100 new jobs, head to our website, WLFI.com, for details. Reporting on location in Lafayette, Alex Dyro, News Channel 18. Alex.